So I was exploring and uh, one of my fan requests was where would I spend... So a previous fan request was where would I spend my quarantine and I actually picked a winter cabin but then I also found this tree house house and I would definitely spend some time here. So today I'm just going to explore this awesome tree house place and let you know what I would do to pass time during the quarantine. For one, I've got a radio. So lots of fun stuff to do there. And then there's just like, you know, crafts and things. I can build a little chair. That's just, that's pretty sweet. I can just put that down and I can sit there. There we go, very fun. So I always have a chair to sit, put that on the bench. Looks like I can recycle things. Oh, looks like there's a, a leaf person hanging out back there. <laughs> so I have someone to talk to. And this looks like the shower. That is pretty sweet. I mean, I can, you know, just take a shower. I mean, imagine the view from this uh, treehouse, right? I mean, it would be pretty awesome. And then I've also got like these tools so I can fix things around my treehouse. Then of course, I'm very curious. Don't want that on my head, thank you. What's in here? I got two little rooms here. Oh, that's the bathroom. Bye-bye, just gonna go potty quick. Looks like I've got a book that I can read. Little frames and things, those are cute. Toilet paper, a must have during quarantine. Looks like I've also got some like wood and some more tools in here. Some jars. Oh, so I can like, I can definitely plant stuff I imagine. Do, 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 do. Can plant some uh, cherry seeds in there. Put some seeds in there. Looks like I've got a bunch of scraps that I can uh, use to make things out of. Oh, I made a basket. I made a fan. Oh, little iguana. <laughs> He's cute. I'm going to let him hang out right there. And again, like I've got some more stuff there. And I bet maybe if I give that some water, maybe that'll grow in a little bit. So I've got my little tool shed. I've got a cool like helmet up here if I want to go zip lining. Remember, always wear a helmet when you zip line. Safety first for sure. I've got this creepy bug, nightlight bug, but I can zip line. How cool is that? Bye bye, wee! I mean, how fun would that be to zip line between this treehouse? That's just awesome. I've got a little koala, hello! <laughs> and I think this is a monkey? Yes! <laughs> That's amazing. Look, I've got mangoes that I can eat anytime. Yum. I've got a pecan bird, or a toucan, not a pecan, a pecan's a nut, toucan. And you know, like, I love all of the animal noises that I just find that like really relaxing. So I think if you're gonna be in quarantine, then I think that would be really kind of like nice. And I've got all these fresh fruits that I can enjoy. Let's see what's in the recycling bin. I guess I can't go in there. Avocados, which I'm not a big fan of in real life, but um, many people are. And I've got a book, I wonder if I can read that. It says Flora and Fauna. So this book tells me all about uh, the plants uh, and things that are in my little area here. I can follow this. I got some candles for nighttime reading. Got some beautiful flowers. And I've got some friends who are apparently backpacking here. They've got little sleeping bags that would keep them nice and warm. And they've got, uh, let's see, toothbrushes and forks and just changes of clothes and stuff. So they're, dude, they're ready. They're gonna stay here for a while. And now we've got like some bats and I have no idea what these guys are called, but they are super cute. Uh, oh, it's too bad this uh, this plant over here does not, uh, wow, I ate the whole thing of bananas. Too bad the, the praying mantis plant, like down here, I know you can't see me tapping, but uh, down there on the bottom right, too bad they don't do anything. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, Venus flytrap, that's what it's called. Okay, let's uh, go back here and let's see what this place is like at night. Let's see what kind of goodies we find. Anything behind there. Oop, I'm wasting my water. Got to turn that off. And then once I get sleepy, I come over here. First and foremost, look, I've got a butterfly. I've got honey. Oh, that's so yummy. Watch out for the bees. Bees can be dangerous. Bees are important, but they can sting you. So you have to be super careful. Took that honey, I'll get a little bit more. Delicious, I can water all these things and then hopefully they'll grow. Look, I can I can put some seeds in there. Potatoes, watermelon, and I guess maybe uh, cucumbers? I don't know, I can't tell, it's kind of small. And then like, you know, mulch, <laughs> which is, <laughs> looks like that's actually manure with the little poopy thing. 
And then let's see, if I water this stuff enough, oh yeah, there we go, look at that! I am growing plants like you would not believe. Here we go. Look at that, I am just like self-sustaining. I love watermelons, that looks amazing. I'll eat the whole thing. I've got a butterfly, we'll put him there. And it looks like a potato. Oh, this is so cool that I can just grow my own full food. I mean, that means that you could pretty much like sustain yourself here for quite a while. And up here we have my little boudoir. So this is where I'm gonna sleep. I've got some slime, I'm gonna put that in my hand. I've got a little mosquito hat. So I'm gonna take my cap off. I'm gonna take my helmet off and I'm gonna put on my mosquito net because you don't wanna get bitten by mosquitoes. That's always a bad thing. Got my flashlight for when I need it at night. I got beans, I've got a Bunsen burner. I've got a little mat that I can probably unroll. Maybe not. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna move that over here. Can use my little Bunsen burner. I can put on a pot and then I can cook some beans. Gotta add some water. There we go. Add some noodles. Got my honey. Ooh, camera. Put that back. I wonder, is there a way to take a picture? I'm not sure. If there's a way to take a picture with the camera. Oh, I got it. Do I, I just have fat fingers. I have to like, you have to tap that red button, but it's, it's with my shade right now. So I'm gonna move that and boom, there we go. Okay, I figured that out, that's awesome. Gonna turn that off, do not go to sleep with a Bunsen fire burning. I got lots of pictures here, I can hang them up so when I'm you know, missing like family and stuff, I can see them. I'm gonna put my flashlight down and turn it off. I'm gonna put my slime down. Let's turn off all these lights. I think it's basically time for bed. Wind chimes, that's cute. All right, let's see. Now, the one thing, do I have pajamas? Let's see if maybe some of my friends brought PJs. Um, okay, I don't need that fork. Nope, that's a dress. Well, I don't know if I have pajamas anywhere. That would have been helpful. Got some solar panels here, but basically I'm ready to go to sleep. I'm gonna put my mosquito net down. So this is the other place that I would spend my quarantine if I had to, this super sweet tree house. Let me know in the comments where you would spend your quarantine. And if there's anything I missed in this rockin' awesome treehouse, let me know. All right, bye.